Push Gref and Maria, and I got you, and welcome back to a new video. Today, we're not doing a video on RPN on, because doing all the names on the name figures is really difficult to do, so I need some more time with it. But, instead of that, we're doing this. And for you to hear from Taya Taya, we're doing a tier maker video. What's a tier maker video? Actually, tier maker video is actually that's we uh, You go to tiermaker.com and you pick your thing that you want to rank. This could be anything Pokemon, anime, other stuff that you probably like. And then you get a category and then you have to rank stuff. So, uh, uh, for example, with Pokemon, you can do the first stage evolution. Starters, the middle stage solution, starters, or the final evolution with starters, and we're doing actually almost all of them. Uh, I, I didn't, so I was I was going to do just to put them on the screen, and I have it also on my phone, so I can see it on my phone, and then I put a uh, picture on the screen so you guys see, and then I can talk about what I'm actually saying. Um, there are actually a lot I have, I have, so I'm not going to do a video of all of the. Tears. So I will go first with the small ones, see how much time I've been recording. If it is a long time, then we we'll still and we do a two part video or we do the bigger ones. So let's begin with some short ones. I was here on my phone, so for me it looks weird, but for you guys, for see the picture, I hope future me, let's do it. It's gonna be a little awkward. So, first off, I have here a lot of them. Uh, I'm just going to scroll and see some small ones and see which one I will do. Uh, we will do the evolution actually first. Uh, evolution, so in D tier, I have Flareon because it is really weak. Oh, also, I'm because there are a lot of the um, tiers I have, I will uh, do a really quick description of what I'm going to say and what my opinion is on these things because. These team makers are all my opinion guys, so if you disagree with my opinions, let me know in the comment below what your opinion is. Because maybe, well you know what, you can do it yourself, so go to teammaker.com or I do a link in the description if you wish me would do it. But yeah, um, if you listen to first, so Flamin wants it in the D tier, because it is the weakest one of the evolutions. In Gen 1, physical attack was high, but it has no physical moves. Uh, no one is C tier. Okay, B tier, B tier is actually the one I like, but those don't hit, so they're okay with me. Those are Umbreon and Flareon. I used Umbreon before, and Flareon is just a cool Pokemon uh, evolution after all. Um, then we have Espeon, Glaceon, and Sylveon in A tier. They're just cool Pokemon that I really like, and I've heard, I think I used Sylveon and Glaceon before because that uh, was cool. And then the best one, C tier, S tier, is. Umbreon, hey, eh? <laughs> is Leaf Young and Jolteon. They are just my favorite evolutions and I like them, so they are uh, C S tier for me. Uh, now we go to the professors. D tier is this girl, you're probably asking, who is she? Well, she was the one of the Dreamist in Termination 5, but Dream, uh, but Dream World got shut down, so it wasn't really used that much, so she is pretty forgettable. Then in no one is C tier, in uh, B tiers are the ones I like but don't hate are uh, Elm, Birch, and Professor Burnett. Uh, I'm surprising that Professor Burnett isn't, but eh, they're okay for me, I guess. I don't hate them, don't like them. Uh, A tier, we have Jupiter, Oak, and Sycamore. I really like these guys actually because I don't know the goals anymore, but yeah, they were just really cool catches. Professor me. And S tier, we have Kukui. And Rowan. Rowan is just a really serious guy, and Sydney is my favorite game, so it's probably nostalgia. And Kui is because he's the most champion uh, of uh, Sun and Moon. Uh, let's, let's see another small one. Here we have some types. Uh, CT, we have the Rock, Ice, and Normal type because they were not that strong overall in Gen 1, and now they're also not that good because Ice and Rock has a lot of weakness, and Normal just isn't that good. Uh, B tier is almost all the time of fighting, dark, electric, flying, ghost, poison, ground, steel, water, psychic. Because, yeah, I like some both of them, some not. Well, okay. Uh, A tier is dragon, bug, and grass. I really like those types. I think grass and bug is really underrated. As a child, I really like the grass type because Bulbasaur and some other Pokemon. Because 
and dragon mist is cool. Then my favorite type on the S tier, we have fire and fairy. Yes, that's a hairbrush. If we, if we get the fire fairy type, I really like this. I really think it's my favorite Pokemon. It, it, because fire, a fairy, a fairy is on fire. That's a really cool type for me. And another Rushman when we have the two legendaries. You see it here with Kudra and Dragonite. They're just really goofy to me. I don't really like them. I don't say that I hate them. I just really don't like them. Uh, B tier is Salamence, Metagross, and Tyranitar. I don't really have an opinion on those guys. They're just cool. Yes. Cool mangas, by the way. Uh, A tier, we have Dragon, Guard Jump, and Combo. Oh, man, it's gonna be a hell of a video. Um, yeah, they're just cool. I like them. Never used them. I like them. So, they're my favorite on the S. We have Hydreigon because I like Unova and Hydreigon was pretty cool to me. Next up, we have games. There's another one, games, but that's a different one. This is just some of the generation actually because, well, I'm just gonna show it. In D3, we have Ruby, Ruby and Sapphire and Emerald, just a generation in one. So, let me say just Gen 3. Gen 3 overall. I did not get much of Gen 3 or some on anime that never played the games. Uh, C tier with gold, silver, crystal, red, blue, and yellow. Uh, yeah, Gen 1, Gen 2. I also not, never played those games. Two on the first console, but was not a big impact on me. Uh, A tier with Sun, Moon, other, from other Moon, X, Y, and RS. They're just cool uh, games to me. I like them. Never, don't really want to play them again because the intro is really long and yeah. But yeah, okay. Uh, we have black, uh, we have black, white, black to white to diamond, pearl, platinum. Those are my favorite generations. I like those games. I want to play them all the time again and do the same teams because I really like those games. Uh, let me see another small one. We have the Pokedex. The Pokedex on uh, B tier. We have the Jota Dex, the Kanto Dex, the Hoenn Dex, and the Alola Dex. Just the look of the decks are not that much for me. The reason why Alola Dex is on uh, B tier is because Rotom won't shut up in Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon. He asks, he give me some advice I don't ask for, then give me, don't, don't give me that advice then. Ah, uh, A tier with the Sino Dex and it's a favorite game. Then S tier with the Colors Dex and the Unova Dex. Why do you have the Colors Dex the de Dex there? Because I really like uh, this sort of hollow plan. In a Reaches and just, I think just like you know, the you know, Dex. I really don't know why, but I like it actually. Next up, we have the Ultra Beasts uh, C2 of Celestia, Persephalon, uh, Stakataka, and uh, oh, what is the name? What's her name? Oh, it's going to bug me. Uh, Fermosa, that's it. Never used them, don't really know that much about them. Don't really like them. Uh, B tier, you have uh, my name, Ligo. Goslord and Zerg Tree. Like them, use them in the Battle Tree, and they were actually pretty good. And uh, the eight in my favorite, I don't have an all time favorite, but we have Buzzwolf, uh, Katana, the Sef, the Poipo, and uh, Nage, Nagade, Nagadeo, Nagadelo, Jeebus. Just those for those of almost, I like them. Because they're cool or cute. Next up, we have the region. This is the region overall. What do I think of the region? In the B team with the Kalos, uh, Johto, Kento, and Hoenn. Just, I don't play a lot of Kento, Johto, and Hoenn. And Kalos is just pretty small for me, actually. Uh, AVF Alola. I really like this. It splits in four islands and I like the trial thing. So, yeah. And of course, Esther, Sinnoh, and Unify because it's my fav favorite um, regions and also my first regions I've played. Next up, we have the champions. In D team, we have. Um, Dianta and Trace. Never played Let's Go. Dianta is this week. Let's move on. C tier with El Elder. I want to put Elder actually in B or A tier if you could fight him earlier because you can fight him in the story. You have to wait until the post game and then you have to be the lead for again and then battle Elder. In B tier, we have Steven, Lance, and Wallace. They're just okay to me. They were tough, but not like, oh, I'm. I wanted to do it again because they were so tough. No. They have, then we have ATV of Iris, Kukui, and Blue. They were just actually strong trainers. They were actually the opposite of Lance, uh, Stephen, and Wallace because they're all using one type. 
while those are using different types. And of course, as there we have Cynthia, the best waifu, I mean the best uh, champion in this game, best champion. Uh, I think that is actually it for the small ones, so I see I'm recording for almost 10 minutes. Uh, I think I'm doing, going to do the other ones uh, too right now uh, because YouTube my niece. Um, which one should we do next? I'm actually looking for which one should we do next. You know what? We go for Ash's companions. Ash's companions on D tier. We have Max, Rotom, and Axu. They're just annoying. I hate them. Why were they even in the series? I don't. I don't. I don't like them. Okay. Okay. Next up. We have the S here with Silent, Iris, and Trish. They were okay in anime, but they were not like needed in anime. Because they have, they have Brock or as, as, or, as, or, as, or as a companion, we could have Bianca instead of Iris. And then have Iris as a second champion. Then in B3, we have Piplup, May, uh, Sophocles, Misty, and Tokopi. They're okay to me. I don't really like Tokopi actually, so probably Tokopi should be. Eight there, but it was actually pretty weak and never did a lot. So, just like the other ones, they just okay. My favorite, my actually, those these are one of my favorite characters. But I like them. The eight tier is Barney, uh, the Dene, uh, Clement, Don, Lana, Malo, Lily, and Kiawe. They're just cool characters to me. Then it's S tier. Why should they even say? There's Ash, Brock, Serena, and Pikachu. If those three are actually on a journey, I think that's actually the best group ever. You have the Gen 1 lovers with Brock, and you have the later one uh, lovers with Serena. So, yeah, I actually think this would be uh, pretty good. Alright, next up we have Mythical Pokemon. And no, that's actually a, a fan of Mythical Pokemon, so... We see... Uh, Fionn, why does it exist? Why? Is it, is it just a wasted uh, Pokedex slot? Then in CT we have Manaphy, Volcanion and Magina. Their events were just trash, alright? They just were given, you have to scan a QR code and boom, you have Magina and then for Volcanion go to your local shop and you can get them. There's also a lot of other ones, but they have something else I don't really like. On B tier, also there are some form 4s that are on other tiers. So we have Marsheda, we have Pirouette form and Loetta, Jirachi, all the Deoxys forms, all the Shaman forms, Metal and my metal, Zero Aura, uh, Hoopa, normal form, DNC and Mega DNC, and uh, all the Caldeo forms because they were just okay to me. Then, A tier, that's my favorite, we have Celebi, Mew, Darkrai, Arceus, Victini, normal Meloetta, Genesect, and Hoopa Unbound. They were just cool or cute, care, cute Pokemon in the anime, or just in the games overall, I think. Alright, looking, 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 looking. You know what we do? Ash's Pokemon now. Ash's Pokemon. Uh, D tier. Charizard. I hate Charizard. Note, not just in the games, not just in the anime. I hate it overall. It's so freaking overrated. Oh, sorry. In C tier, we have Glalie, Butterfree, Unvescent, Larvitar, Baldor, Ash Greninja, Palpatout, Pidgeot, Sokaleo, Poipo, Rotom, Ruticate, Meltem, and Hunter. They were just Pokemon that are just really short in the anime, or Ash gave it away, or he just it wasn't it wasn't really on his team like Hunter and Sokoleo, or they are just they don't have a lot of screen time. Except for Ash Greninja, I just hate Ash Greninja. Why does Ash have to be a special bond with Greninja? Why does he have a special bond with Pikachu? Because Pikachu is more, is, yeah, he's, he's a little more with Ash than Greninja. So why does Greninja have a special form with Pikachu? God, B tier. Extra points I like with a hate. We have, oh, it's gonna be a long one. Primate, Mark, Restoros, um, Bayleaf, Lycanroc, Livenny, Totodile, Swallow, Corfish, Torkoal, Gabite, Busel, Tetera, Staraptor, Steptile, Quilava, Apom, Noiver, Kudra, Halucha, Teneflay, Rowlet, Dunfen, Ashwat, Big Knight, Snivy, Squirtle, and Kingler. Oh, there was a lot. They're okay to me. Uh, a tier, we have Heracross, Lapras, Snorlax, Noctowl, Scraggy, Bulbasaur, Crocodile, and Torkin. They're just really cool characters, but they're my favorite because my favorites are Glassgore, Pikachu, and Infernape. This is all Ash's Pokemon, right? 
So just my opinion over I just spoke overall and I probably of myself a bit because yeah. Nostalgia, of course. Uh, we just had Ash Companion. Let's talk about Ash and his companions. Rifles! I don't know all of the rivals' names, just are going to give some names. What if we have D and B tier? D tier? G. My, last fa my least favorite. We have Big Lips, we have Blazing Guy, and we have that other girl. I don't know her. Those three, I just. Why the word? I don't even remember them. So why even bother them? C tier, they're just playing annoying. Uh, Dragon Killer, Riolu Guy, Trip, uh, Silence Rifle. C Cactus Boy, uh, Pink Hair Girl, Glasses Boy, Meowth Boy, and Eevee Boy. They were just annoying in anime or were just there. Eevee Boy. You never fight with Ash, so why even bother? B tier, okay for me. We have this guy, Roses Boy, uh, Dance's Rifle, we have uh, Sawyer? Uh, well, the guy that no one knows his name. Then we have Trevor, Shauna, and Cherno. Uh, we have Harp Guy, and we have the man, the boy with the methane. Just okay. Some memories of them are okay, but I some of them are okay. Like Shauna, Trevor, and Cherno, they are better in the anime than in the game. Actually, uh, A tier. Those are actually some characters I really like. We have uh, Alan, Zoe. Uh, Oh man, I don't know the names. Was was the guy with the Pikachu and his rifle of Serena? Oh, I can't remember. It's so bugging me. Ah, oh, they have Ch uh, Trevor Cherno. No, the green guy. Ah, uh, Beyond Ga and, and Barry. If you know the guy's name, please leave it down in the comments because I don't know and it's really bugging me. And in S tier we have Gladion, Paul, and Gary because. The best rifles in all of Pokemon, actually. Uh, let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. I think I did almost all of them. Yeah, I think that is it. There are still someone I didn't did, but they were actually pretty, pretty long. So, yeah, I'm going to leave this episode here. We're going for almost uh, 20 minutes. So, I'm going to leave this episode here. Hopefully, you guys liked it. Go to teammaker.com and show to me what your and let me know again what your tears are in some of these tears. So uh, I'm going to do part two because I will do a part two because the other ones are actually longer and probably want to talk about more about them. So I'm going to go almost, almost for 20 minutes. So yes, this was part one. See you guys in part two. I agree guys, later.